Choose either the house example or your own discipline and then list and describe three detailed design tools or aids that you have seen used to assist technical people to come up with satisfactory design. If possible, include references to where people can find extra information on those tools so that we can all benefit from your experience. Detailed design aids are essentially tools to help us arrive at an adequate design as quickly as possible. Design aids are really very industry specific. For example, I'm an electrical engineer, so I'm most familiar with detailed design aids used in that profession. For example, I'm familiar with a variety of computer-aided design tools, modelling and simulation tools, and rapid prototyping environments that assist electrical engineers to come up with the best possible designs against specified requirements. These tools allow engineers to explore possible solutions quickly, easily, and inexpensively. They also allow us to break things in the virtual space so that we don't have to break them in the real space. This not only reduces cost, but it's also critically important when we are dealing with safety critical systems that could injure or kill people if they fail. We simply must get these systems right before people are exposed to them. These tools also allow us to explore the all-important design space in order to come up with preferred solutions. There are plenty of methodologies and tools that help with trade-off analysis. Have a look at Multi-Criteria Decision Analysis, or MCDA, as an example of a decision-making tool that can be used throughout the systems engineering process. Quality Function Deployment, or QFD, is another tool worth looking at. You will find plenty of references to MCDA and QFD on the web and in selected systems engineering textbooks.